Hello, good ladies and gentlemen. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Happy Sunday. And uh, I bless each and every one of us who uh, entering uh, into this uh, new week. I said it shall be well with all of us. Our homes, our offices shall be blessed and our shops. Anywhere that we are putting something up for sale, my dear, we must surely find customers. Anywhere, uh, the issue where can we come here on are the people where they laugh also. Where they talk say that the uh, headsmen are, are nearly to destroy the southeast, which is the Yoruba people that went to who, who keep on making just of us. Now, I can't see Abakovanya. According to Igbo language, but I can't see Abakovanya. No. <laughs> I beg you, forgive me. Oh, this one, I just wrong interpretation. But the truth still remains that uh, uh, we are still on top because whatever that is happening in the so called. Uh, Yoruba land can never uh, be compared to what is happening in Biafra land. In other words, we are better than them by far. Not minding that all the whole security investment, everything have been channeled to Yoruba land because they are uh, guy on top is the president. But as it stands now, the South is even, even better than them. Multiple injuries as the men clash with our metal cooperatives in on those stages. And according to the Kepu Kepu where they hear, they said, um, the Fulani head has said, that nothing that will stop them not to take over the whole uh, the whole uh, uh, southwest as it stands now who say they don't even care whether tunumbu is the president of the zoo or not that they are in a mission to conquer and take over the land because according to them they said the southwest and the north east northwest and north central belongs to them in fact they want to pursue these people out from their regional they say they want to conquer that place and make it a muslim uh, country <laughs> My brother, wonder shall never end. Anyway, let us reach um, between the lines. In another de development, to make on see how corruption can never end in Nigeria and how injustice that, will, that can never end in Nigeria. Breaking news: Eberechi uh, happens to be the wife of uh, Nigeria's Chief Justice Ali Wales Ali, which is Nelson Wike. That is Eberechi in Nelson Wike. Others make final court of appeal judges list. <laughs> Ah, uh, so and I go see the reason why the so called uh, yes on weekend speaks arrogantly because to him now his wife will become the chief judge. So, any case that are going to deal with the yes on weekend must be at the court that uh, his wife is the judge. And you tell me that this arrogancy, this impunity, this uh, high height of hypocrisy that is uh, developing the so called zoo is going to stop. I doubt that. Anyway, my people, if you get this message, please help me like, share, comment, and make sure you subscribe to my channel for more interesting videos coming your way. I don't want people to talk, say, I don't they talk too much now. Let us read in between the lines. Several personnel of the Under State Security Network Agency, known as Amatoku, were reportedly attacked by bandits suspected to be his men. Nigerian news gathered that the incident occurred on Friday in Akure, the state capital, and resulted in various degrees of injuries to the operatives. The Amatoku officers had earlier arrested approximately 120 cows that had allegedly destroyed farmlands in OC and the Iboba communities in the north local government uh, area. While transporting the cows to the state headquarters of the Amatoku command in Akure, the headers ambushed and attacked them on the Akure Ado Expressway. A source informed points that as the officers were taking the arrested cows to Amatoku headquarters in Akure, they were attacked by headers with armed, okay, headers armed with dangerous weapons in the Sango area of Akure to prevent the cows from being taken away. A viral video captured some Amotoku officers firing shots into the air to disperse their attackers while the injured one were swiftly moved into an Amotoku Hilux van. The public relation officer in Ondo, Amotoku Jimo Adenikan, confirmed the incident and said that an investigation is underway. Breaking news, Eberechi, wife of uh, Nigeria's uh, Chief Justice, Ali Wales Ally, in some week, uh, others make final court appeal, uh, court of appeal uh, judges. Now, they, now, like this, they go take a uh, finish uh, uh, injustice, what that is going on in the judiciary, and uh, the high height of hypocrisy. I weep for this nonsense country. Justice Eberechi Suzette Nwike from Rivers Judicial Council was on the list of the priority nominees sent to the Fulani, uh, uh, Federal, uh, Fulani Judicial Service Commission. Eberechi Suzette Nwike 
wife of Minister of Federal Capital, Territory and Jason Wike, and 21 others have made it to the final list of the Court of Appeal judges. The President of the Court of Appeal, Honorable Justice M.B. Dongban Mensem, had requested the appointment of 22 new justices to the Court of Appeal, which included Eberechi Suzette Wike. Justice Eberechi Suzette Wike from Rivers Judicial Council was on the list in May. Sahara reporters reported that the National Judicial Council at its plenary of 115th meeting held on May 15 and 16, 2024, approved the appointment of H.C. Judicial Officers for the Flane uh, and the State Courts. The, the Council at the meeting also considered the recommendation of its interview committee on the appointment of Judicial Officers of all superior courts of record in the zoo and resolve to recommend the HC judicial officers for appointment to the court of appeal high court of uh, the Fulani capital territory sharia court of appeal and the customary courts of appeal of states in nigeria sharia don't enter into the courts hmm. it noted that all recommended candidates were expected to be sworn in after the approval of the njc recommendations to the president and their respective state governors a better to date, whose husband was also the immediate fa uh, former governor of River State, was on the list. Apart from Wicked's wife, who made the final court, Sarah Reporters also learned that the following judges also made the list. Polika Potema uh, Kwaha from Benue State, Rukuyate Ayola is from Kogi State, while Eneche Ele, Ele Ojo is from also Kogi State. Asmara Akambi Yusuf Ukwara. Uh, okay, Yusuf from Kwara. Abdullahi Mohamed Lehman Nasrawa. Abdu Dugu Federal Capital Territory. And Fadao Omar from Bruno State. Others are Ishak Mohamed Sahni Kaduna. Zeneb Baji. Abubaka Kebi. Abdulaziz M. Ankara from Zamfara. Namde Okwi Dimga. Victoria. From Abia State, Tuochukungo is from Anambra State. Henry Aja Ono Njoko is from Ebony State. Donato Tuwezoke Okoronko Enugu Ngozeka En Okasebo from Imo State. Ntong Festus Ntong from Akwaibom. Ne Nezena Idumudia Afolabi from Edo State. We have Latifu Babajide Lawala. Akako, Lagos, Abiodun, Azim, Akenyemi, Ogun State, Oye Wumi, Oye Jojo, Oye Bola, Oyoyo, everywhere, Oyo State, and Bayo Ademola, Taiwo is also from Oyo State. Sahara Reporters area reported that uh, members of the Fulani uh, Judicial Service Commission had advised the National Judicial Council, uh, Council to nominate Wicked's wife and other 21 judges as their priority for appointment as justice of the court of appeal justice oluka yode Ariwola is the head of both the fjsc and the national judicial council in 2022 Ariwola attended a dinner held in his honor in portacourt by the river state government under then governor wiki at the event Ariwola backed his kinsman and your state governor Kinde, for his membership of the g5 which was led by yesom wiki the G5 comprised five agreed People's Democratic Party governors. Wiki, then Benue State Governor Samuel Autumn, then Abia State Governor Okezi Pazo, Sehima Kinde of Oyo State, and then Enugu State Governor Ifani Uguani. The agreed governors called for fairness in the PDP, insisting that the then national chairman of the party, Senator Iyocha Ayu, must step down to pave the way for someone from the South to succeed him. Since the party is a presidential candidate, I think Abubaka hails from the north. That is why we should not be scared to have these men of the integrity group. And I am happy that my own governor is among them because he will try to imitate his friend and in law because uh, we came here to marry for my governor. So, Governor Wike, we always threaten that. He will call back his sister if my governor fails to play ball. That is why you see him following his excellency, Wiki, because my governor is afraid of his wife being recalled. 
Ariwola has said. Anyway, my people will be like saying, "Here we go take bad break." It. This one I just says short news to uh, to enlighten my people what is happening, and uh, the those who are first now have become the last. In even even not minding that they are Oga on top is the president of the zoo. Whichever way we take see this news, I beg make it manage on that way because we are coming back today is Sunday and it's going to be fire for fire. Expect the unexpected today because I am going to give you all you need to know or you need to hear from Okute Daily Talk. Keep up the good work and keep on listening. Keep on subscribing. Keep on liking. Keep on sharing. And make sure you keep commenting to this channel for more interesting videos coming your way. Bye for now, my people. Kemesiano.